So we're doing our very first. Okay, so yeah, Watch Along Wednesday, we are doing The Conjuring, and I guess what we're going to do is just do a brief synopsis. I can talk. Do a brief synopsis, like the IMDb synopsis, and then we'll start the movie. And I'm going to try to, like, hit the space bar hard enough so you can hear it in the recording, (laughs) so that if you're watching along with us... You hear the jump scare? (laughs) You... (laughs) I just get scared. I'm like, stop! (laughs) No, uh, I'm We're gonna, gonna slam hit the, on the table. <laughs> this space bar when we start the movie, so you can watch along with us. You can start the movie when we start the movie, and so on and so forth. So the IMDb synopsis, which is like the larger one, uh, not just the little tiny one at the top of the page. This is the larger one written by an actual um, reviewer. Is in 1971, Carolyn and Roger Perrin moved their family into a dilapidated Rhode Island farmhouse. <laughs> I don't know why I stopped at Rhode Island. You had a hard time with that one. (laughs) Uh, And soon strange things starts happening. Soon strange things start happening around it with escalating nightmarish terror. In desperation, Carolyn contacts the noted paranormal investigators, Ed and Lorraine Warren, to examine the house. What the Warrens discover is a whole area seeped in satanic haunting in a sa- satanic haunting that is now targeting the Perrin family wherever they go. To stop this evil, the Warrens will have to call upon all their skills and spiritual strength to defeat this spectral menace menace at its source that threatens to destroy everyone involved. So that was the synopsis. If you've seen this movie, great. <laughs> <laughs> and if not, well, listen to us talk while you do so. And we may or may not annoy you, but we don't care. It's fine. (laughs) Okay. Uh, This was requested, so this is fine. Yeah, requested by someone, so we're doing it because of you guys. (laughs) So suck it. (laughs) Okay. I'm going to hit the space bar. And go. I got it. Awesome. I love this fucking opening. I've always loved this opening. I like what um, all the just, what are they called? Production companies? What they do with all their openings. Um, how, like, the the WB goes into the New Line Cinema and it, mm-hmm. like, oh, it's just all a part of it. It's yeah. So cool. Instead of the, the old, just, like, WB opening that's always just bland. The, wasn't the, the WB thing was the, no, that was... Something was the like Statue of Liberty Lady or the Flying Horse, and there was a oh, bunch that's of them. Uh, Paramount, I think. I think so. Yeah. Um, WB was the the Water Tower. Yeah. Fucking creepy doll. I hate her. <laughs> I thought the Raggedy Ann doll was bad. Yeah, I really loved how the Annabelle. You still haven't fucking seen it. Never mind. I also hate the fact that the Annabelle movies don't have anything to do with them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I would rather see them than the first, the one I watched, because I haven't watched Creation yet. Yeah, the Creation one literally goes into the new one. Or goes, Creation goes into just Annabelle perfectly. Like, perfectly. It's really cool. We should watch it. <laughs> Never fucking do that. Yeah. Who the fuck? <laughs> I'd be like, no. <laughs> I want to contact Lorraine and be like, so tell me, who the fuck says yes? Nope. She'd be like, oh yeah, dumbasses. Miss me? No. Ooh. Yeah, fuck no. <laughs> Same. Sitting in the hallway. Ooh. And then the freaky, nope, the crayons, nope. I also don't like her her acting in this storytelling she's like we left her in the other room it's very dramatic yeah which i get it's supposed to be but because this was a this was our very first introduction to anything lauren yeah how the fuck did she get on the ceiling damon <laughs> she levitates up to right <laughs> no wonder it looks so messy nope 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 I straight up, Sick. I hate that crayon scene because I expected her to just like fall, fall like, or ah. like or like demon crawl across the floor. Ugh. Let me. But 
But I think the I think the charm of Annabelle is the fact that she, you don't see her move. She doesn't, except when do she like kind of turns her head. Yeah. I fucking hate the knocking. The knocking freaks me out. I hate knocking in general. Yeah, even at home. <laughs> I'm I like, know. shut up. I'm not home. Like, don't fucking knock on my door. <laughs> Especially if it's at night and I'm home alone. I'm yeah. like, fuck you. Whoever you are, go home. It's not worth it. <laughs> exactly. I'd rather be alive. Listen right. to my dog. He's scary. I love her hair. The pigtails? No, not hers. The black hair one. Oh, okay. It seems like a very uneven cut. That's because, I mean, it's supposed to be all like, she just woke up from sleeping. <laughs> nope. Nope, nope, nope. Put it down. Run away. And just close the door. <laughs> Nothing <laughs> happened. Oh, God. Oh, shit. I always forget about You forget that. about that door? <laughs> I always do. Oh, my God. When I first saw this movie, I like halfway prepped myself for it. I was You're like, like yeah, it's in the house. Happened. It's in the apartment. Yeah. Me too. Same. It's actually weird because you think that like they got the doll a long time later, but in the Annabelle movie, she's all fucked up too. I don't know why. Who buys a fucked up looking doll? I don't know. I think. Oh, okay. So in the very, in the very first one, she's not fucked up the creation she's not fucked up because it's literally the creation of the doll so ignore me but but in the Annabelle movie when he buys her the doll at first before the break-ins and stuff Mm -hmm. she looks fine yeah well yeah that's because they continuously throw her in the trash and oh yeah you're right you're right yep yep yeah now you're panicking right what (laughs) (laughs) i love this scene oh my gosh it's called find elizabeth warren elizabeth warren what's her name again lorraine lorraine why do i do that anyways she's (laughs) somewhere in the crowd she's in the crowd oh is she yeah maybe she's the old lady um Uh, no she's in one of these rows I wonder if she's in the. Oh, oh I think she's back in the back area. In the back, there. like up there. Yeah, because she's definitely in here. Up there? No. Maybe. Is she? Oh no, she's skinny. She's not. Fucking love him. Me too. The scene coming up is always so sweet. The way he looks at her, it's so I know. sweet. Oh, where'd you go? I love this. The bright oh, there's yellow. another classroom scene. Maybe she's in the next classroom scene. Yeah, she's in the classroom scene when... Right before Car- the mom shows up. Yeah, so Carolyn comes to see them at one of their teachings, and then she meets them outside. Yeah, she's in that scene, I think. Okay. Fucking love this music. When I first saw this, I was like, this is going to be good. This is going to be good shit. <laughs> I'm honestly kind of ashamed of how long it took me to actually see this movie. How long did it take you? Um. So when Annabelle came out originally, before Annabelle Creation and all that, my friend said, oh, this is a prequel to The Conjuring. And I said, what's that? You didn't see The Conjuring until after Annabelle came I out? I didn't see oh Annabelle. At, I, it took me years to see this movie. Oh, my God. I know. As soon as I saw this, so like, I think I mentioned it before, I watched Insidious and then I was like, ooh, what's The Conjuring? And then I watched The Conjuring and I immediately pulled my sister into the, in our back apartment area and I was like, you're watching this with me. <laughs> I was, I thought she was such a weird choice for the mother. I don't like her. I don't either. Like, later on when she's all spooked out, her grunting and stuff I don't is like it. so weird sounding. I don't like it. That's about the point when I stopped caring about the movie. <laughs> Straight up, if I was this family and the dog didn't come inside, I'd be like, huh, mm. I understand we just sunk all our finances into this place, but... Mm. Dog knows best. Yeah. Dog always ne- knows best. This dog's name Sadie, I think? Sadie. Yeah. Sadie. <laughs> Bubba, we weren't calling you. <laughs> no. No, Bubba. Lay down. Sadie's crying, not you. Lay down. Sorry, that's our that's, that's my dog. dog. 
<laughs> it's one of our other mascots. Lay down. Now. I like this montage, how it's like briefly happy. Until weird shit starts to happen? Like, it just jumps you in right away. Oh, oh yeah, because then they play hide and clap. Yeah, mm-hmm. like right away, and then they find the basement. Creepy basement. There's a basement behind a... We should have learned this with, <laughs> <laughs> with Don't Be Afraid of the Dark. There's a creepy basement that's hidden. Don't go down there. Unless it's a finished basement, I will never go into a house that has like a legitimate basement. Just because... You mean like a finished basement? Like uh, those ones where they turn them into like a rec room. Oh, yeah. No, I still won't. Sorry. <laughs> and, then, and then our little Twilight girl there. She was the daughter. In Twilight. Oh, was she? Oh, yeah. cute baby. Fucking never. Nope. I I actually really I like, like that little box. The little I do too. Box. And then this scene, I it, it took me like two times to realize it, but after the music starts, it all gets darker. Like then, the actual visuals? Yeah. It got darker for a moment, and then once the music stopped, it got bright again. Yeah. Fucking nope. This is such a weird game. Right? Five fucking girls. Maybe try a condom next time. (laughs) Ooh, I like that little scale. I never noticed that. That's That's such an old house. Oh, God. True. Oh, God. (laughs) Same. <laughs> Did you see the new movie she's in? The Wish Upon? Uh-uh. Where she gets this like, Chinese wish box and she gets like three wishes. And every time she makes a wish and it comes true, someone dies. It's... Is it okay? It's okay. I would, I would recommend watching it. Push into the weird murder basement. <laughs> <laughs> also, Me. why would you like tackle your sister? Oh, God. Sorry. Damn, Christine. Oh, my God. Every time he says that, I'm like, why not just use a flashlight? <laughs> oh, know. wait. <laughs> it's Flashlights weren't common in the 60s, were they? I have no idea. I think the Warrens have flashlights. Yeah, but that's because they're, like, wealthy teachers. That's true. <laughs> and they're like chickens. we've been demonologists for a while now we've got some backing <laughs> we could afford two flashlights <laughs> uh, oh fuck cobwebs the fucking house in california had cobwebs like that all the time blech. just like when we walked out the door and i was like oh fuck i hate cobwebs i would always scare people what do you see down That well, was this me. match hasn't burned my finger yet. Right. There well, it is. I, did. <laughs> <laughs> I would immediately just scream going down there. Roger, what have you seen? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone would hate me. <laughs> I like how she's already nervous. Like, the, the come on up. Like, right? don't get murdered. Same. Same. Spiders. Spoders. Saw a spider yesterday and I was like, ah. Did you I, get that I one st- that was up in your roof? Oh, it disappeared. <laughs> Ooh, that's the worst. I know. It's somewhere in the ceiling. Yeah. Oh, right? Sadie. Fucking Sadie. I'm glad they, like Evil Dead, I'm glad they get it out of the way. That's like, true. really soon. And we don't see it. Yes, you can. She's a dog. She'll eat bugs. I got her on a chain. You should have not got her on a chain. She'd be alive. Maybe. Well, she's alive right now. Well, I mean. Sexy time. Sexy time. Maybe don't. (laughs) Maybe put on a condom so you don't have six kids. (laughs) Why do they have two lamps on that table? One is a decorative lamp, thank you. (laughs) It doesn't turn on. 
Oh, and this is the 60s. There was like no ambient noise. So you guys having sex on a creaky ass bed. Oh my God, those poor girls. <laughs> I like how you could hear the rope just then. Like I'm the shit. And this was back when she had to wear heels to get out of bed. Oh my God. Little tiny pumps. She's like, I gotta make my legs always look good. Except when she has like, you know, blood clots. <laughs> Definitely weirdo bruising. Have you ever slept with rollers? No, fuck I... no. I'd rather die. <laughs> I I hear they're not very uncomfortable, like, because they're all foam. My grandmother used to, um, there was this really funky smell. <laughs> Yeah, fuck no. Problem Problem solved. solved. Such a mom answer. Right? Uh, Anyways, my grandmother, in order to not fuck up her poof uh, before she got breast cancer and lost all of her hair, Mm -hmm. she used to sleep on a neck pillow. And it was like a roll only on her neck. And so afterwards, once she she lost all her hair and she started, like, using a pillow pillow again, she's like, I'm never going back. (laughs) That was terrible. I can't believe that. Oh, we found a fresh flashlight. No, that's his, uh, him plugging in the light. Because apparently, oh no, he did find a flashlight. He probably just had to unpack it. Ugh. I love the sepia tone to this whole movie. I know. It's so pretty. Honestly, even if this movie was bad, I would just watch it for how it looked. Yeah, it's beautiful. Don't touch it. Ugh. Ominous notes. After I saw this movie, I actually went back and watched a bunch of James Wan's old uh, movies, and they're nothing like this. Yeah. This is, like, a unique piece. Huh. Like, um, Saw, it's very blue. Yeah. Uh, same with, uh, Dead Silence, the one with the puppets. With the, yeah. That one is, is very gray. This one's yeah, the only one. Yeah, that's a weird, one. but all of the colors on the dolls popped. Yeah. The reds pop. Yeah. Very much so, Yeah. But he also does that with Saw, too. All the red pops. Yeah, this was... I think this was the one that he first did all pretty, like... How fucking traumatized is this girl gonna be in, like, three seconds? Right. She's so fucking adorable. Can you hold my sweet teddy bear while I find our... Murder Almost dog. cut in half dog? <laughs> Every single one of them? What did you do to me last night? Oh, uh, poor little girl. I love her jacket. I know, it's, it's so, so cute. Uncomfortable. Ugh. Is it cut in half or is it just No, like, he's strangled? just got a she's got a huge gash. She's definitely bleeding. Oh, I haven't noticed. I always look away. I'm actually looking now, dead dog. Oh. I could have swore. I don't know. It might have just died. Maybe. It didn't look like he pulled anything off of her or anything. He just kind of died of fright, probably. What movie am I thinking of? I mean, do you watch a lot of doggy snuff? No. (laughs) I try very hard to avoid it. (laughs) Oh, the Warren basement. I love it. I, I will take a movie of just explaining everything in this in this freaking room. (laughs) Especially that cat head right there. <laughs> Just because it's a cat head. Yeah, it's like an Egyptian-ass cat head. I want it. Don't, Don't touch, touch it. it. He just fucking said. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, well, oh, okay. I do like the authenticity of An- Annabelle's case. Yeah. Do you not like it? I just, I'm just upset about, like... I understand they needed to make it like a creepy doll, but it was it was just a raggedy end doll. That makes it creepier to me. I know because it's sweet and innocent yeah. looking. Yeah. But how are you gonna how are you gonna sell the Annabelle movies looking like that? You can't. Did you see those like off uh, off brand ones where it was like Charlotte? Oh yeah. <laughs> there was I also. I think that's on. That's on Hulu or Netflix or something, it's and it's got somewhere. that weird like wallpapery background too. Yeah. Oh my god. But it's totally a knockoff. Well, yeah. <laughs> a demon. Positively do not open. I like how it's all like, 
the font. I know. It looks like a Ren Fair. Yes. Maybe that's where they got it. Oh, probably. I mean, all they have to do is put the tarot card of the devil and just lock it. Why the tarot card? That's what's on there. Oh. I don't know. Ask, ask <laughs> Lorraine. I don't know. Kids. Hey, gator. he got a gator head, just like me. A gator skull. Mine's not that big. Georgi- oh, Georgiana's the mom. I'm like, who the fuck is Georgiana? Who the fuck? I, oh, honestly, I like that headpiece. Right? I wish that Lorraine had done Georgiana's piece. Or Georgiana's uh, character. Oh, that would have been cool. That would have been too much of a nod, though. They... I guess the fact that this is not really what happened makes it so they want to, like, disconnect a little bit. Well, I mean, unless you actually know what, like, Ed and Lorraine and Warren actually look like, I don't think you'd... Yeah. I don't think you'd be able to know until you looked it up and you're like, who's Ed and Lorraine Warren? When I first saw this movie, I'm like, is she crippled? Because <laughs> <laughs> she was just like sitting in a chair, not moving. I'm like, get up and drink your tea or chase your daughter at least. Right. But... And She's like realize... post trauma. Yeah. Just... I mean, I'd be the same way. Sam's like, do they ever explain what happened to her? And I was like, no. They do. They don't fully explain it's the it. Second one. Uh, have you seen the second Conjuring? No. Oh my fucking god! You're I know the worst. worst. <laughs> if I have to actively look for a movie, I'm not interested. Isn't the Conjuring two on Netflix? No. It's just the Conjuring. They always do that. They I know. Just, just one. And that's why this is my background noise movie right okay. now. Well, when we do our like one fest, yes, we'll do all of them. Good. That'll be our first one fest, including the nun. Yeah, I want to do that around when The Nun, I think it comes out in September. So we'll do that then. Hot. I mean, we can obviously do it beforehand. This is why I don't <laughs> sleep without blankets over my feet. Little demons. Have you seen that uh, YouTube video? No. Uh, <laughs> the guy, he like he like plays with the demon and every time he puts his foot out, the demon's hands comes up and then like he like puts it away and he watches it go down. And then eventually, <laughs> like at the very end, he grabs it and pulls him under the bed. But like at one point he's like, Damn. <laughs> the demon <laughs> It was really funny. Ooh. My favorite meme is a, uh, or it's like a text post or something. It's a, uh, I, I sleep with my arm hanging over the bed now. Demons might as well take me home. <laughs> I was take like, me yeah. Now. Same. Nope. Yep. Stinks like sulfur and dead bodies. Blech. If your farts smell like that, you have an issue. You're <laughs> the fucking doctor. Oh. I hate that. <laughs> Those hard cuts sometimes really get me. Oh, I did it. Oh, it was you the rest of the bad one. No, I just got two more small ones of the bad one. <sighs> Why'd you get so many? Because. Because of those deals, man. <laughs> <laughs> those Costco kombucha deals. Something. Oh, it's the doors. Yeah. It's the other daughter. God, I would literally i don't know if i could ever live in the 60s when the like after, after, at midnight and like the american song came on and then the static like all things ceased on television until like five o'clock or six o'clock in the morning oh weird yeah that was the big thing about um you haven't seen the original poltergeist so you would you don't know that but that's where oh you're right i haven't seen the original the poltergeist here yeah. yeah, I've just seen the Family Guy version of it. <laughs> I mean, once you've seen a spoof of it, you've pretty much <laughs> seen the whole movie. <laughs> we'll watch. God, I'm gonna. I have so many movies for you to watch. I'm it's... so bad with like. You won't be anymore. That's why I'm moving our shit to only Fridays, except for a couple of things, so that all day Thursday when we're writing notes, you're just movies. watching horror movies. <laughs> Love it. It's the kind of nope. life I wanted to live. This is the kind of life. Yep. <laughs> Sam doesn't watch horror movies with movies me. Movies and talking. Mostly just horror movies. Yes. <laughs> talking you... too much hurts my throat. <laughs> we should I do... miss those fucking lamps. They hurt. They burned. Well, yeah. You're not <laughs> supposed to fucking touch them. Yeah. I think they caused like a few house fires. And oh, stuff. yeah. Probably. <laughs> like, maybe not. The sun needs to stop moving. It'll get there. We know what happens. 
Why is the window open? That's what he wants to know. Yeah, right? <laughs> I like how the first scare is really, like, explainable. Yeah. They kind of explain, oh, God. Except for creepy daughter. Katie pooping. <laughs> Hopefully it's Holmesy. That's definitely Holmesy. Because she's actually using the litter? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know where my oh, tiny I like demon that bookshelf. Is. Oh, that's fire. cute. Nope. 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 You've seen a lot of things before, honey. Nope. Also, can we just say fuck weird built into the house wardrobes? Nope. <laughs> what? I guess, yeah. Why can't you wake somebody to sleepwalking again? Uh, because they can get scared um, and become violent, like oh, aggressive. Like, you don't like wanna, a night terror. Yeah, kind of you thing. don't want to traumatize them. Because taking them out of it, it can be like a night terror, yeah. Or, I uh, think. Like a sleep paralysis thing. No, because they're moving. Wait. Hold on. <laughs> Why does sleepwalking happen if when you go to sleep, your brain tells your body to shut down? I think that's why sleepwalking is so unique. Like, I don't know any sleepwalkers. I don't either. Yeah. The worst that I know is that Flynn, when he gets up in the middle of the night to go get a tortilla. <laughs> <laughs> but he's awake. He's just kind of half asleep. He's but just yeah. like, I want a tortilla. Yeah. <laughs> he, gets, he literally gets the midnight munchies birds also fuck that if birds start flying into the fucking basement windows right. nope i'm out also he snapped his little birdie neck yeah poor bleep. fucking thing bleep. <laughs> same that face i'm like the fuck <laughs> uh. also how cool is it that the bus like actually stops right outside their house i guess I mean, yeah. <laughs> mine... I mean, mine only did because we lived in an ac- apartment complex. Same. But, like, everyone else had to go to the top of the hill. Yeah. Well, for a second, I thought that was a Pokemon chest. <laughs> You're like, wait like... a second. <laughs> Time travel is a thing. Uh... Yep. Nope. My friend's husband's name is Rory. <sighs> fucking this little this little bitch i hate it when she does this oh when she does the pop goes the weasel she's the creepiest Mm. fucking kid yeah any kids are creepy i have a a creepy child episode that i want to do i have so many things creepy child episodes aren't hard i know there's so many (laughs) that's great she starts to like panic yeah fucking kid (laughs) i'm glad they don't put any noise there though it's just her going boo instead of like a clack or something or a loud like (sighs) yeah can we no nope no we can't (laughs) apparently that's for good reason (sighs) ow definitely just tied her hair into that thing yeah kids kids <laughs> period look at that wallpaper that's too much i don't know man childhood nostalgia Except you had not... wallpaper like that no okay. i lived in apartments <laughs> it's all lead anyways in the 60s it's fine lick it <laughs> <laughs> oh uh. sam was like freaking out at this scene he's like something's gonna fucking pop up i don't want to see it i don't want blah, blah, blah. And i was like honey just focus <laughs> just no it's so quiet same <laughs> nope Ugh, the third clap grosses me out yeah mm-hmm. There's a scare coming up, guys. <laughs> Except not really. I mean, it's more of a... It's more of a spook. A spook. A spoopy. It's more of a ooh. 
Why is there a rug in front of it? A rug and another rug and rugs in front of it. Nope. Also, this has to be Rory. Because he's got little sleeves. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. Rory is the child ghost we see everywhere. Nope. What? What? Little sleeveys. Nope. You wouldn't know your child's clap. And also that was all echoey and shit. I know, right? <laughs> but remember, we're we're not supposed to judge. Yeah. We're not supposed to judge? Why? Oh, I didn't realize you could hear it breathing. Yeah. Oh. And also what child girl child breathes. <laughs> <laughs> Um, new. Nope. Remember, we're not supposed to judge how other people react to things in movies. Yeah, we just react the way that we would react. <laughs> yeah. Do you like the color brown? I don't like the color brown, like on people, like in clothing. Yeah. No, I don't like it. I also have a hard time with like camo green. Uh, like the darkest camo green like forest green as clothing listen leave my car alone <laughs> no like the the like the really like acid washed green like on army it, jackets it really depends on how it's worn yeah. for me i like it as one solid color yeah well i like i like emerald like emerald on some people it's gorgeous yeah but like the really dark you have nothing else Pulling on the ankle. Stop it, Nancy. Fucking. Put your fucking blanket on, then. Yep. Yep. I Same. love the, the bass tone that happens. It actually broke my speakers the first time I watched this Really? Movie. Oh my god. Every time that happened, my speakers would go. Oh no. It was a really old TV, though. It was like an old plasma from 2013. Oh, no. Jesus. No, 2003. Never mind. Jesus. It got so hot. <laughs> you like, have to turn on the AC just to watch TV. Yeah, actually. It did not do well in California heat. My ear's ringing. It's really not adding a good ambience to this movie. <laughs> I've never slept underneath a window. Um... I feel like something's gonna come out and grab me, like reach in through the window and go yoink. Um, I think. Oh my god, that's the stupidest fucking thing you could have done. Like I don't never. look under the goddamn just, bed. Just hide under the covers like a normal child. Right. Don't look for things. Also, don't watch the door. Kind of start closing. Uh, I always expected something to be under there, or like step in front of the bed. I. Every single time I watch this movie, even though I know you physically cannot see anything, You're always like... <laughs> I'm always looking. Like, I want to see what you see. Right? She does Scared so good. She does. I and hope she continues to do movies. She like, does. scary she's in, movies. Yeah, she's in Wish Upon. See, I haven't seen that. We just and talked then, about this. And then she, um, she's in that new Netflix movie, The Kissing Booth, with the guy... Who is so weird? The guy she has a crush on in the movie is named Flynn. Whoa! <laughs> and I let Flynn listen to the uh, trailer, and he's like, "That's fucking weird," and then walked away. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's obviously not alright. She's pissing herself. Yeah, right. Do you see the contortion of her mouth right now? That's a scared mouth. I would be her because I'd be like, "What the fuck are you looking at? What the fuck are you looking at? I can't see anything. What are you looking at?" Right. <laughs> nope. But she's also, like, super calm and collected about it. The sister? Yeah. Well, that's because she doesn't see anything. Oh, that's true. She's just like, you're fucking crazy. You're having a nightmare. Go back to sleep. You're sleepwalking. Except this is the wrong child. Yeah. Oh, God. I wonder what she actually sees. I wonder if she's seeing the Bathsheba. You mean, uh, oh, God, what was Sam calling her? Sam Sam called her like bath time fairy or some crap. <laughs> it's standing right behind you. Eh, 
door slam. Oh. Oh, smells. Smells. Smells and breathing. Does she smell it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. She goes, oh, my God, it really stinks. Same. See, and then this is what I don't fucking understand. They go in. And the sister with the glasses is like, I don't know why she's screaming. I just saw the door slam on its own. But why is she screaming? (laughs) She's like, I don't know. I don't know. She's still not freaking out. Like, who the fuck wouldn't freak out? Right. Yeah, she's more freaked out by her than by yeah, the door shutting. Yeah, she's got the tension in her neck. Can we hear a heartbeat? I can hear a heartbeat in the I headphones. heard something. It went away. After you said it, I heard something. Oh my god, that's so crazy. No wonder the tension in that scene is so high. Right. Winston. I like the chicken with the fro. I love them. They're so fucking cute. And also, like, after I saw the actual picture of them, I was like, man, he is not that attractive. No. (laughs) Sorry, Ed. Ed's, like, rolling in his grave right now. He's like, (laughs) fuck you. (laughs) I mean, maybe at one point when he wasn't Uh, no. Larger. (laughs) Mm -mm. No. In all the pictures I've seen, he's not this pretty. Sexy time. I love his smile lines. He's so cute. Mm -hmm. Pretty much, like, every time he's in the scene, we're just gonna be like, "Mm." Mm, (laughs) Boy. He's such, like, a a dad figure. What does that say about us? I'm into dad bod. I don't care. Dad bod and dad figure are two completely different things, but who cares? Oh, my God. The pipes are creaking. I like how she's freaking out and he's just like, fuck. Ready, ready. Nope. Same with Addicts. I just watched Black, the remake of Black Christmas last night. Yeah. And there's a bunch of bullshit with the Addicts. I hate Addicts scenes. It's fucking creepy. Just like The Exorcist, the show. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't. Fuck I'm with that. so happy you guys. See Sam those. was like hiding during that scene. I was like, no, you have to fucking watch Did you catch this. Up? No, damn it. I know. Yeah, you got weird, freaky blood clot bruises all right? over the place. Time to go to the doctor. She did. That's oh yeah, she... that's right. That's why she's got meds. Oh my god, this scene freaked me out the first time. I hate the, <laughs> the child giggles. Child giggles. <laughs> In the subtitles we're watching, it just, ugh, it says child giggles. It's worse. Easy steps. Nope. 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 You're never gonna hear a clap again. This clap the same again. You sure, right? <laughs> fucking Maureen. See, you're being stupid about this. I just turn on every fucking light. Right. I'm like, who the fuck's following me? Let's go. Oh. Jesus. I hate this shit. Turn on every fucking light. Right? Wake up the whole goddamn house. Who cares? Look at how big that landing is. It's huge. I know, right? They don't build houses like that anymore. No, there's not enough space. Yeah. <laughs> they even subdivided this huge plot of fucking land. They still yeah. managed to get this huge ass house. It's a goddamn mansion compared to what I'm used to. Oh, this whole scene is when it goes down, right? I think so. When what? When, when... she first pops up? Uh... No, that's that. No, and then after this, she goes downstairs, gets locked in the basement, and then we see Bathsheba for the first time. Oh, yeah, because he comes home. Yeah, got yeah. It. And he's like, what the fuck? This is literally when it's, not at its worst, but Does when somebody it's... want to tell me what the hell is going on around here? Yeah. I remember now. Shit, those shits are expensive. Yeah, fuck. (sighs) No 
Nope. I hate those kinds of clocks. I love them. Grandfather clocks. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, I don't like them now thanks to Insidious in this movie. Oh, yeah. That's your own fault. (laughs) I was like... Um, I used to spend every summer for like a month at my grandmother's house and she had one. Yeah. So it was like a, like a childhood thing. I really oh, like them. So it like helped you fall asleep and stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Like but it also game. told me how late I was staying up because <laughs> it just chimes and chimes and chimes. Nope. God, there's so many rooms. Right? You can get fucking lost in that house. It's great. No, it's not great. <laughs> That's why she's in this kind of mess. Now, if you're in a one bedroom, one bathroom, you know exactly where the creaking's coming from. Yeah, it's, I feel like that's worse. At least in something like this, you can go and hide, and maybe the ghosts won't find you because they'll get lost too. <laughs> <laughs> well, one can hope. Yeah. Same. There ain't no window open this time. Blech. Nope. Turn on all. Oh, wait, yeah, she tries. Nope. Oh, wait. This time the light turns on. Isn't there a time where the light... No. I hate all the sheets. Yep. Yep. Nope. Nope. Oh, God. Also, she'd break her fucking neck. Depends. Actually, breaking your neck after falling down the flight of stairs is actually very rare. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That was, like, my biggest fear. You are more likely to break, like, an arm. Or your back, not your neck. Yeah. Oh, and it's the ball. That's yep. right. Ugh. Rory, fucking stop it. Stop wanting to play with everybody. Right? Go be a ghost. Go play with the other weird ghost girl. Oh, God. She looks so scared. Nope. See, the ball isn't half bad, though. If one of those fucking sheets started to levitate, I would not finish this movie. Run away, run away, run away. And that explodes, yeah. <sighs> oh, God. This part really freaks me out. Like, kid laughing aside. This Fuck you, Rory. Scene. <laughs> yeah, now she's gonna hate clapping forever. She's gonna ban hide and clap. Yeah, so you are never fucking playing this game again. Ah. <laughs> uh. Nope. No. Uh, Same. (laughs) Why would he do that? Like, I didn't think that... I don't understand that. I don't understand why... Ghosties like attention. They do like attention, I guess. Oof. The first couple times I watched this movie, I had the hardest fucking time getting through this scene. This one? Yeah, because I just hate her. But, oh yeah... She's creepy. She's very creepy. No. Fucking creepy. Come on, Cindy, wake up. Get your shit together. Oh, God. Also, darn it, it's too bad you didn't wake her up because she's about to be traumatized anyway. Yeah, right? Just, Just be like, wake up, wake up. Let's go into the other room. Not here. Oh, God. Yeah. I have a hard time with the, the music in this scene. Ugh. Because it really... It's the build-up. Yeah. Well, it's not even a build-up. It just starts. It just, oh, like, screams God. at you. You're right. It's like, I'm a demon! <laughs> you see her, and it's like... Wah! Yeah. Ugh. Nope. Fucking Rory again. That's not Rory. Isn't it? No. I, well, I thought it was coming from inside. Or is she just playing with them? I think she's oh just God, invisible God, playing with the doors. Nope. I guess there's a little bit of a, a musical build. Oh my God, this fucking shit. <sighs> oh, I hate this scene. No. I can never get over it. You hear her? Nope creepy child ugh nope ugh yep nope uh, don't turn uh, around don't turn uh, around ugh shit oh I hate her 
Same. Yeah, when all of your fucking family is screeching. Listen, technically only three people are screeching. The other girls are just like, what the fuck is happening? They're just like, whoa! Nope. Same. I love this scene. I love it. I love the shot. It's pretty. Okay, she's somewhere in here. In this scene? She's gotta be, right? Look for her, look for her. Who we're looking for? The original... Lorraine. Lorraine Warren. The old lady. Oh, but it's dark, of course, because they're watching a movie. Well, I think you still see her. So they explain this in the second movie. That's good. Well, they explain what she sees, yeah. Yeah. Fucking... Nope. Ooh, so much. Let's look for her. I like him. <gasps> All the dramatic gasping. Where is she? Where is she? You think she's like in a blurry background? No, I think I very rem- I remember distinctly seeing her. Okay. Yep. I love her collar. It's I beautiful. Know, I know. <laughs> Murdered Eve. Infestation, oppression, and possession. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that's her right there. Oh, God, right in front. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I wonder. No. Not to be that person, but wasn't segregation still going on in the 60s and 63? Uh, probably. Okay, there's a. <gasps> <laughs> Scandalous. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know, man. Let's call him. <laughs> oh, man. Look at them clip on earrings. It's beautiful. I love her coat, too. Oh, yeah. You're. Okay. Whatever. Bye. Sam was always asking me, he's like, do you, do you think that Ed believed Lorraine? And I was like, they're doing this together. You think Ed doesn't believe Lorraine? Really? Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. She's so, I don't know what the word is, like delicate. She's a precious angel. Yeah. She's a weird woman, Vera Farmiga. Like as an as an actual human being, she's very her. strange. I love her. We f- I follow her on Instagram. <laughs> I'm like obsessed with her mildly. Mostly thanks to Bates Motel. I love her peace sign. <laughs> she- <laughs> Demons. I know. I do like the subtlety of that. Where they're just like, oh, she looks really... She's looking at weird stuff. Yeah. But then they explain it later. Ugh. Love it. I love her. She's amazing. Demons. (laughs) He's like, oh, maybe this is real. Were, was it you who said that? Maybe it was someone else. But like I was watching this with someone and they were like he's asking a lot of leading questions and he's also like giving her answers that he probably doesn't actually know the answer to. Like like he's she's like a smell and he's like demons. Like it, he didn't go to any other scenario. He just kind of like fed her fears. I thought that was kind of that definitely God. wasn't me. 
But um, I do have that conversation a lot with... Uh, Seems like Sam would say that. Say, uh, that is something Sam would say, yes. But I have that conversation a lot when it comes to uh, talking about, like, psychics. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Like, Effie actually sent me a text out of the blue... And she was talking about how she was listening to a podcast and they had a medium or a psychic Mm -hmm. in and they were feeding her all the information that she needed and Mm. she just bounced it right back at them. And they were like, oh, my God. Oh. And she was getting really mad. I was like, oh, my God. Yeah. I mean, do you believe in that kind of stuff? I believe that a a psychic in New York was just sued for $800,000 fraud. So you don't believe? No. Okay. (laughs) I can believe in, like, clairvoyancy and stuff, but... I believe in being extremely empathetic towards yeah. people. And yeah. being able to, like, feel feelings and feel pain, but not, like, actual situations or names. Yeah. Like, like with Lorraine here, how she's, like, something really fucking bad happened yeah. here. I believe that, that you can feel something like that, mm-hmm. but you'll have to actually, like, weed out what happened. But a lot of, like, psychics and mediums and stuff, you feed them the information they're looking for because they're just quiet. Yeah. And then you break the silence. Yeah. I like those mugs. I know! Those are cute. Apparently they, like, these types of kettles started a lot of fires. Oh, Jesus. I think everything oh, those are the 60. ones that bubble at the top to show you that they're done. I think so. Yeah. Fucking creepy. I need to move desperately, so I apologize. I'm gonna be creaky. It's not okay. part of the movie. <laughs> <laughs> I like how they're like mildly see through because of the glass. Yeah. Oh, love them. They did that with the green ones. You know, the green ones are mildly radioactive. Yeah, it's the uranium glass. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> Effie. I always bring her up. Effie has a lot of that, actually. And they glow under uh, UV light. Nope. Fuck no. You can totally see him. Oh, God. Love it. I love that music box. I like how... Oh, you haven't seen most of the other ones, but this music actually, like, follows the story. Like, you hear this music in a lot of the other movies, too. Oh. Do you hear it's... in the Annabelle that I watched? Because I don't remember it. I haven't seen that Annabelle in a long time, so I'm not sure. With the weird basement demon? Yeah. He was ugly. No. Oh, this freaked Sam out, too. Really? I was like, yeah, I was like, he doesn't pop out at you, he just stands there. Ugh, with his, like, super his dark raccoon. Stuff. Yeah. Raccoon eyes and his pilgrim gear. I do like that she's looking at the door, too. Did you notice that? No, I didn't, actually. Oh, yeah, she looks at the door, too. That's cool. Love that wind chime. What is this actor again? Patrick Bateman? Is Patrick that Wilson. Wilson, thank you. So <laughs> Patrick Bateman is American Psycho. <laughs> oh, damn. It's fine. At least I got the Patrick part. Um, <laughs> but I like the, I like the thread of... Uh, Patrick Wilson being oblivious of what's behind him with mm-hmm. Insidious in this movie. Oh, that rope sound. Nope, nope, nope. Some pretty feetsies. Little demon feetsies. Sam didn't want to see her either. He was like, no. No. But she's so pretty. Ugh. Yeah, same. If I saw that shit, I'd immediately have a panic attack. <laughs> I love that tree. I drew that tree. Oh my god, her shirt matches the thing in the background. No. Lorraine's feeling woozy. Yeah. Lorraine is tired. Yeah, see, it matches. Oh, Look sick. <laughs> oh, my God. Fashion. Listen, Mama just needs to bong rip some sage. She'll be fine. It's the 60s. 
We're almost that time. That's what I'm thinking. See, I don't like this, though. She sees her here, yet she doesn't see Bathsheba. Well, I think it's because that's where Bathsheba died. Yeah, but she only sees, like, a, a ghosty Excuse shadow. Presence. Yeah. I think they... I hate that when she says, uh, it doesn't matter where you go, it, like, echoes. It goes, go, go. <laughs> I'm like, what? Not always. Lots of lots of. There's like five. Because there's the the son, the mom, the nurse, the nurse lady. At the, least the, those. The. I think there was a. There's a girl because the 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 mom in the basement's holding a girl. I don't think she's holding Rory. Oh, I thought that was Rory's mom. Oh, maybe so. There might be six. Because they explain, they explain who the ghosts are in the when they go home. She yeah. brings out a map and shows everybody. Rory might be the boy who drowned. Yeah, he is. But so the mom is crying, saying she made me do it. Yeah. We'll get there. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Jumping ahead of myself. Big ass property. Fucking right. It reminds me of uh, Bathsheba very much reminds me of The Butcher, American Horror Story. I didn't watch that one. Oh, Roanoke. So uh, Kathy Bates plays The Butcher in the reenactment portion of it. And her thing is very much anybody who's on my land uh, gets killed. Huh. So, But it's only during like the fall harvest. Hmm. So during the reenactment, they were there in the summer and nothing happened. But then... Um, the second half of the season they go back and like the real butcher and all those like the real people come through and they're like holy shit it's real but anyways um it very much reminds me of this this is cool this freaked me out those ring <laughs> supernatural conferences Nothing. The whole time. Uh. Yeah, we hear it now. You hear what? She goes over it now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, Jeebus. I mean, what do you expect when you marry someone named Bathsheba? Right? Did you know that that was never proven? The in front of the fireplace? Mm -hmm. Huh. I haven't looked into any of the actual history of this stuff. I like my horror to be entertaining. <laughs> right? I just really like the Warrens, even though I... My brain prefers to call her Elizabeth for some reason. <laughs> oh, she's... So that's yeah. Mama. That's yeah, Rory. that's Rory. That's so weird. And that's... Giant plot of land. Lots of death. Jesus. 200 acres? Right? Okay, so there was two drownings. Demon screams. This fucks me up. I hate it. <laughs> and Sam was like, wait, why did the demon follow them? I was like, because the demon's a gum. A gum? Gum on the bottom of your oh, shoe. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I'm always scared when I listen back to our podcast. I'm like, gotta hear something weird in the background. Oh, like when I thought I heard a woman say hello and I freaked you out. <sighs> yep. 309 307 there yeah. we go I, I got that one time <laughs> one time one of my friends or something asked oh, me what I time love it the bus. was sorry uh my friend asked me what time it was and i was like oh it's 3010 
it's <laughs> like, okay. That's a real time. Oh, God. I've always wanted a Volkswagen bus. I love them. Did you see they're going to redo them? The bugs? Mm-hmm. Or the, the bus. buses? Yeah. That's cool. I really like the, uh... oh, God. What do they call the other one? It's the, the one with the bed that pops up on the top. Mm-hmm. The camper ones. Oh, I love those. Camper vans. I love camper vans. So good. You guys should get one for your um, festivals and stuff. Have you been to the the Hagen and Woodville recently? We went together and we saw the thing. Oh yeah, that thing. <laughs> yeah, I want that. Oh my god, look at those chairs. Love They're them. So old. Retro diner chairs. They did really good at the uh, furniture and stuff, the decorations to actually like age the movie properly. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I love it. Like even the doorbells are right or doorknobs. Wow. Yeah, where there's ceramic. Yeah. Mm, love I love it. I love his uh, cardigan. Oh God, yes! <laughs> Look at that; it's great. Oh, beautiful! With the argyle crossing, and, oh, <laughs> love it. Oh, could you imagine the mosquito issues you had during the summer? Oh, Jesus. On that still lake. <laughs> Fuck that. Asshole. That was so <laughs> ridiculous of saying that. Such a dick. Suicide. That you know of. Well, that's what his wife knows. He, he's like, what? From that bridge. <laughs> I'm gonna move. Because <laughs> same. <laughs> Um, mm. what happens a lot oh yeah yeah how can a mother kill her own child Ugh. I mean think about animals when we're when we're looking into fish the ones we want to get are black mollies or just mollies in general and yeah. they were like always get female and female or male male because if they are female and male they will have babies like rabbits and they will eat more than half of them yep <laughs> it's an insight yeah, oh see, my I, god, I have to pee. I hate my life right now. Oh my god. It's fine. I won't get up. We only have half the movie. All right. Actually, you're right. You want to take like an intermission? Yes. Okay. Intermission I'm, during the happy beach scene. I'm pausing it right now. The girls are all at the beach. Okay, I gotta pee. Okay, and we're back. Michaela has peed. Let's restart the movie. It's good. And go. <laughs> I fucking love this shit. I understand that we want to, like, feel sorry for her when she gets all spoopy, but, like, I don't really feel like that was necessary. I feel like them getting haunted is shitty enough. Yeah, right? We didn't need that emotional shit. (laughs) I love how this blew them away in the 60s. Right? (gasps) UV light. Woohoo. Groovy. Groovy. What did he, what did she say? Is that what she says? Far out. <laughs> Far out, man. Yeah, oh, she groovy. says groovy. <laughs> What's her? I really want to know the contrary. She seems familiar. Now, Who is? The, the girl? Yeah, the oldest daughter right there. If my Ew. fucking Creaky door. phone... Oh, dude, look at the person who played Bathsheba. <laughs> Joseph Bishara. Hmm. Which one? Oh, Shanley Caswell plays the oldest daughter. She's 26 years old. Oh. Oh, that's where I know her from. Hmm. Detention, which is a weird movie that we need to watch. Hmm. It's such a good movie. I got really California then. Such a good movie. Such a good movie. <laughs> like, it is such a good movie. All the crosses. Yeah. You just get all us? the fucking crosses. <laughs> I like how his uh, Ed's pants are like perfectly pressed. Right? He always has to look good for his demons. <laughs> Gotta impress them deems. 
Oh my god. Your nails are bad. You should feel bad. Whose? They're super glossy. They're just shaped bad. Okay. Bell jingles? It's not him. He already went pee. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. He's like, I'm filming this cup. Oh, this is... Which one is this? This is just the door. Oh. Well, yeah, because I think this is Rory coming out of the basement before he grabs uh, Cindy and takes her upstairs. Probably. That's Cindy, right? Yeah. The one who sleepwalks? The sleepwalker. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love that microphone. Yeah. We need to find a microphone that we can take with us. I mean, we can take this one with us, but it catches a lot. I mean, that's not necessarily a bad thing. No. There's two little droplets on it. It's not on the speaker, is it? No, it's right here. Okay, that's fine. No, don't. <laughs> not even once. I love those big honking uh, headphones. I really want a pair that I can use in public so, <laughs> so people can be like, oh, she's not. Of fucking Kyle. What? Every time I was wearing my headphones at Mox, he would still come over and talk to me. And oh. then he'd be like, I'm interrupting you. And I'm like, yep. And he's like, I don't care. I'm like, well, fuck you too. <laughs> no, she's just keeled over and now being weird and ghost like. Nausea. Oh, okay. So Joey King is the actress who saw the best she would in the corner or whatever she saw the little girl the the one who got her foot pulled yeah okay she's in wish upon but then she's also going to be in the new slender man movie <gasps> Ooh. yeah i think i remember her from when does that come out she's gotten older oh yeah she's much older well August. i mean yeah <gasps> what it comes out on flynn's birthday no the day after flynn's birthday oh i mean you're leaving you're going somewhere in... is it that week yeah Oh, oh, oh. oh, yeah, I think it's the 24th through the 27th. Yeah. We can... S no, because you're... Are you <laughs> I love this <laughs> face. I like how he's just holding <laughs> an apple. He... It looks like he took a bite before. You definitely heard him chew just now, and that was gross. <laughs> Did, uh, the clock just turned to 308. Yeah. It's 308. Dun, dun, dun. Those chairs look creaky. Oh, it looks like a good breakfast. Mm -hmm. We made banana pancakes the other day. Oh. So fucking good. Ice cream! Oh no, I want to stay at home and get vomited in my mouth. Blech. I love In a long time, you've been there for like two weeks. Well, I think the house is the family. Oh, got it. Laundry. Look at all that floral. Ed's like, no, we can move here. We can move our weird murder basement here. God, right? So much floral. I know. It's ridiculous. Little pancakes. I love this uh, this scene oh that's coming God. up. Because before I had seen this, I had no idea what it was from. And I just loved it. So I told Sam when this uh, when we were watching this for the first time together, He, I was like... So, have you seen that gif of a lady doing laundry and then one of the sheets blows off and it blows to the form of a person? He's like, oh yeah. I was like, yeah, this is me right now. <laughs> uh -oh. And he's like, what? <sighs> That's weird, because when I first met you guys, I thought that he liked horror more than he does. I don't oh no, he's a scaredy cat. Probably because he had to go see them with you. You had no one else to see them. Oh no, he he wouldn't go with me to see horror. Oh, -uh. okay. It wasn't until we started hanging out that I actually went and saw new movies. Ah, yeah. Well, you're welcome. <laughs> well, thanks. Oh, I love this. Uh, uh, oh god. Then it hits the window. 
Which, that's a cool transfer. Yeah. Same. Demony. Oh, I hate the noise. Oh, the vomiting? This. No, this. The woo Oh. I like how they were like handprint. Oh, God. Ugh, I hated and this. this. Very dead silence. Yeah, the scream that's not actually a scream. It's very insidious, five keys, or the last key. When he turns off. Oh, her we screen. watched a synopsis of that movie. I'm not. A, I'm not interested oh, it's anymore. It's fucking stupid. Yeah, it's really stupid. I saw it in theaters. I know. I was supposed to go with you. Yeah, it was stupid. It was another one of those where I was like, mm, I'm "Glad I, I saw this. Go? We're kind of free." <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. You think you have demon vomit in you? Demon vomit. And she's like, uh, oh, oh, okay. Okay, crazy. <laughs> sure. That's exactly the kind of reaction I was looking for, was just I'm feeling a little woozy. <laughs> nope. Mm. Look at those uh, flare pants. Hot. Yummy. Love them. <laughs> Are you going to tell me when I can fucking change my plan? No. I told you to email them. Seriously, email them. I know. I will. It's my next bill date. Wrenchy, wrenchy. Yeah. He's like a crutch. Whenever I saw this, I was like, yeah, I wouldn't want them to leave either. Right? Fuck no. He's the biggest skeptic, so it's a lot. His clothes are always so pretty. He's just a pretty person. <laughs> His wife is pretty too. She's a she's a pretty woman. His IRL IRL wife. Yeah. His IRL. <laughs> And they still don't explain it. Oh, a real, real big, big piece. piece. Ugh. How did she... I always wondered that. Because, like, you can't go without water for more than three days. <laughs> Unless you drink your own pee, but. <laughs> I mean, if there was a bathroom attached. Oh, maybe. Like sink water. But houses in the 60s didn't really have attached bathrooms. That was a, a more contemporary. Like, uh, master suites were very contemporary. Look at. Is that a camera? No, it's not. You're going to see creepy nursey oh, soon. Oh, fucking. This one scared me. Even though I knew it was coming. Oh yeah, because she screams in your fucking face. Yeah. She's a dick. Ghosts want attention, as per you. They <laughs> do, sorry. Ghosts okay. decide when they want you to see them, and obviously she's crying out for attention in this. Well, they're probably getting more active now that Bathsheba is more active. God, so much florals in the in the sixties. Right. Nope. Nope. I mean, wind. I know exactly. I was like, it was windy this morning. Yeah, fuck that. Except now, because of that stupid Taylor Swift song, whenever I watch this, oh god, look what you made me do. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's the spinoff I want. <laughs> <laughs> Taylor, Taylor Swift meets The Conjuring. Yes. Yeah. Don't do it. Ugh. Just stay outside. Actually, don't stay outside. That's how Sadie died. Yeah. Just, just don't follow her. You can look at her. Just don't, don't go near her. Ugh. Hi. Bye. Oh yeah, she wasn't a nurse. She was a maid. 
Hi, bye. <laughs> Listen, are you going to follow a weird lady with slit wrists? No. Nope. I wouldn't either. Yep. Run away. No, he's not. Right? <laughs> he is upset. More florals. Ugh, Cindy. Cindy Lou Who. I do love Taylor Momsen. She's great. I like her band. Yeah. The something reckless. Pretty. The pretty reckless. Pretty reckless, yeah. Some ghost, obviously. It's her BFF. Oh, it's not hers. It's no. Me. Well, Rory's definitely protecting her, though. Yeah. At least trying to. Well, that's what he says. This is where I hide when I'm scared. Does he say that? Do you hear that? It's safe. Oh, yep. Oh, God. I like how you can see their breath. It took me two times to see that. Oh, in the room? Because it's freezing? Yeah, because ghosty. Yeah. I didn't see that the first time I saw this movie. He doesn't know. (laughs) (laughs) A UV light. He smashes it. Right. <laughs> and that's the end. Oh, lordy. Oh, yeah, I guess it would be easier to see because it was just, it's cold in there. So yeah. their feetsies would be. Get it? See, but why would you be able to see ghost prints? Like, I understand these are all Cindy's, but like, ghosts aren't. I don't think you see ghost like, prints at all. Well, I mean, that's why they have the UV light, right? Is that they have the UV light to see where ghosts has been? Oh, yeah, and it's like. But ghosts are non is it non corporeal? I have no idea what that word means. Not physical. Yeah. I think I don't know. That sounded smart. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'll have to look into uh, the usage of UV lights. Well, that's probably that might have been just what they used back then. Yeah. Let's see. I'm googling now. Non- Oreal. Fuck is... this. Yeah, spiders. So, corporeal is Latin for corporea, or is the Latin of of the nature of a body from corpus body. So yeah. To appear bodily form. Oh no, non corporeal is bodily form. So I don't know what the word would be for someone who could actually be touched. Well, the ghosts can do physical harm on people. Okay. So, like, they can, um, like, rope. push you around and shit. Yeah. Yeah, but phys- uh, corporeal, corporeal itself just means to be in the form of a human. Nope. And she knows. I see no fucking noose. Also a badly tied noose. Yeah. Nope. Oh god. This scene, ugh, it makes me panic a little bit. Especially being locked down there. Fuck. Nope. And then again, with the ugh. creaking sounds. 
Okay, I need to look at the the kid to make sure that is Rory. Because every time it doesn't look like him. Which kid? Right now? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because you see her hunched over. Uh, maybe. Doesn't it, isn't it just that her wrists are cut? She's like uh, cradling her arms. Maybe. Because she's not a small woman. No, she's not. I cut my cuticles too far yesterday. Oh, no. (laughs) It hurts. Why would you do that? I don't want, I wouldn't do that. Nope, not even once. Not even once. (sighs) No, there's Rory. Yeah, it is Rory. It just doesn't look like Rory at first. It looks like too feminine feminine of a face. Children often are feminine until they hit puberty. Yeah. Ugh, I hate that her mouth is fucking open. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. When the music gets quiet. Boom. <laughs> Jesus, how much eye makeup are you wearing? I also like the fact that the ghosts are afraid of her. Yeah. Well, because they possess her. Them. They, yes. She possess- what? She okay. possessed <laughs> them. So they're afraid of her still. Oh, Blech. God. I hate this. The fact that it fucking turns- Ooh, stops that. Stops. <sighs> Same, Lorraine. Same. Nope, 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 nope. Fucking feet. Nope. That's right. Obviously, she's. Oh, God. Also, why I don't wear long necklaces anymore. Right. Yep. She's like, what, me? She's like, no, you. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, not happy. Hairs. Yeah, you don't think I fucking see that? <laughs> Imagine being pulled by like that little amount of hair. That fucking that hurts. Would hurt. It's all or nothing, Bathsheba. Come on. Grab everything or don't grab anything. <laughs> no, her hair. Watch in like 20 years, we're going to look back on this movie thinking that this was like the best graphics and be like, what the fuck is this bullshit? Right? <laughs> Like when the, uh, like when the sheet goes up into the window. It looks kind of bad even now. No, I love it. They just. Yeah, but. Rut row. No, no. Fucking kids, creepy children, and creepy children in water. Nope. I love that tree, but I hate that fucking tree. Yeah. Just burn the tree; it'll all go away. I don't think that. I don't think that's how it works. That's how demons work. <laughs> the tree is the demon. Just burn it. Burn it all. Oh god. Nope. Creepy ass coy child. <laughs> I like how the locket is illuminated. Yeah. Seriously, go back and get your necklace. With people. Like, go down as a group and go get your necklace. Right? This is Flynn all the time. When I freak out about something. Right? <laughs> What's wrong with Judy? (laughs) 
Yeah. <laughs> but you fucking did. Time to go home. Time to go home. Yeah. <laughs> See, did they already explain that, like, the possession follows them? I know it says it in the synopsis, but, like... Uh, Ed explains it with the the gum metaphor. But earlier in the movie. Yeah. So why did they think that they could leave and then they would... I don't think that... um, I think Lorraine might know that she's... uh, That Carolyn's possessed... Yeah. But I don't think anybody else knows. Okay. And Lorraine is so fucking traumatized that I don't think she mentioned it. Makes sense. Whew. Yeah. Fucking church rules. I know. This shit. Didn't get it. Ghost, ghost hands. Rory. Oh God, it's fucking creepy. He looks so freaked out. Yeah, I would be too. Fuck. Oh, that lamb is really creepy. <laughs> the lamb, the little oh, smiley yeah. lamb. Fuck no. I hate this shit too. I hate that stupid fucking locket. And how would she, I guess there is probably like an emotional connection, but I just don't understand how she would be able to find her. Well, that's what Sam said too. But I think it's because the lockets came as a set from that uh, Mm. churchyard sale or whatever it was. Yeah. Um, They were like partners. Yeah. So the, the connection between the set plus she's got the picture of her parents and they have the picture of her. Yeah. It could just be a connection thing. Super linked. Yeah. Or they could just be like, look for all the cursed objects. Found her. (laughs) It's like in like the flash or something when they're like, look for the dark matter. Right? Ugh, they also have a creepy attic. Oh yeah, fuck those. I'm so happy. Like, in apartment buildings, those kinds of attics are only ever in like the top apartment. But yeah, but then your poor Adam Ellis is right over your freaking apartment. Yeah. Ugh, the door's open. Nope. Letting Actually, the demons that was out. weird. What? In the first uh, lightning flash, you see something on top of the cabinets. Oh, no, it's just the eagle. Okay. Whew. <laughs> I was like, ugh. Never noticed that before. Don't go in there. They've won. Oh, Fuck no. Time to nope. go back to bed. Nope. Time to scream louder. Nope. Oh, the growling is creepy. Ooh, the creaking again. Oh. Nope. So much knocking. That doesn't sound like pounding on a door. No. Except it doesn't. Nope. Raspy gasping. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, see, this is the only time you see Annabelle move. 
that's pretty much all she ever does, even in the other movies. Well, yeah. That old lady was out. Sleeping like a rock. Even I don't sleep that well. Chewy. <laughs> of course, it has to be like a dark and stormy night. Right. Always. What's wrong in there? <laughs> Get it? Nope. <laughs> Boom. That's actually pretty bad right there. The CGI right yeah. there. Yeah, I never noticed that. But she's there. <laughs> well, obviously... Demons can go through glass. Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, hey. She's still in the case. But I like how because of what they do, they believe her. Whereas every other movie would be like, shut up, you're just a fucking kid. Right? <laughs> Where? She smells She's... like rotting meat. Where do you think she's going? That's right. the one thing. I feel like I would have liked it more if they made it more extreme of a possession. Like, they really only ever really... They really get into the possession once they're back in the house, but, like, I would have liked her to have some sort of, like, demonic tick when she was driving. Like, where are we going, Mom? Or even, <laughs> like, like facial scabbing or something. Yeah. yeah. To, like, kind of freak everyone out more, like, holy shit. But I think, I think the really unnerving part of it is she just looks like she's in a bad mood. Yeah. And that's what's really unnerving about it. Yes. Yeah, you should. You don't know that. Mm, might. <laughs> you need a police escort. Oh, yeah, it's the cop. Never yeah, they have the cop friend. Cop friend who doesn't believe in this. <laughs> He's the guy who... Yeah. <laughs> I love this scene. Boof. Well, not this, but when they... Are you a fan of the choir horror music like mm -hmm. this? Really? To me, it gets, a, it gets to be a little bit too much. It gets to you too much? No, it gets to be a little too oh, much. Okay. Like, at some point, I'm like, all right, I get it. Choir. Yay. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Demons, Catholic Church. Yeah. Like, I feel like they only hired her because she could make those noises. Probably. And this grunting, this, like, screeching. This is kind of cool, though. That's very freaky. Oh, God. Ooh, that growling in the background was creepy. Yeah. Listening to these horror movies when it's, like, in your ears instead of just, like, on the TV. Oh, it's, it's a little different. worse. Yeah. Owie. Oh, fucking. Time for the birds. Right? Who's suddenly in a Hitchcock movie. Yes. <laughs> I do love that movie, though. The Birds? Mm -hmm. I got it. I told you I got it on VHS. No, yeah. did you? Oh. No. I got Maybe Psycho. don't take the shotgun into this room. Right? Oh, 
Ugh. Oh! Yeah, right. Squirting. Squirt, squirt. <laughs> oh, I hate that squelch sound. That was awful. I like how that, that was really the only... That's the only, like, hyper-gruesome thing in yeah, this movie. Yeah, everything else is just paranormal creepy. Yeah. Like, this guy... <laughs> her... me. <laughs> But then when she goes full demon, it's creepy. That's pretty creepy. You can't. There's a sheet over her. I gotta do what I gotta do what I gotta do. I love the relationship. The second one is so cute with them. Yeah. Yeah. There's a scene that just, like, makes my heart ache. Except it's about Enfield and they weren't even there. That's my only problem. Just ignore that. It's entertainment. (sighs) It's fine. None of this is real, according to your exorcisms episode. (laughs) Because you said that a lot of it was just uh, them making it worse and then saying bye. Well, that was pretty much it. Like, at the end of this one, it just got fucking worse. But in the movie, they... Well, yeah, in the movie, it has to be happy-go-lucky. Everybody lived together like a happy family. Yeah. And then this fucking guy, when he finds her... She's in the kitchen! Yeah, let's scream and tell everybody, even the demonic mother. Ugh. Meow, <laughs> meow. Anything with, like, multi-tonal breathing or noises freaks me out. I don't like it. (sighs) Get it? I hate that sound. The weird screechy noises. Yeah. Blip. He's uh, even me like... too. <laughs> You're not supposed to stop, but fuck, I'd stop. Yeah, right. God. Oh. Snickademon birds. Blip. Oof. Fuck no, just let the birds do their thing. Oh, it's the birds. Yeah. Well, yeah. And into the single pane window. Get it? (laughs) Kaka! I love crows. Smart fucking birds. Obviously not smart enough to not go into a window. They're demon birds. (laughs) This is such a cool thing. I like this. CGI crows. Yeah. Aw. It's always the the pigeons. Yeah, the pigeons are the one. uh... And also, wait, it was crows doing the circling. Why did pigeons fly into the... Was it all birds? It's all the birds okay. in the area, I, I think. I thought it was just crows. Because the first bird... <laughs> it's like the pigeon's like, hey guys, wait up! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. April, shut up. She's hiding. Yes. Diable. No. <laughs> you can't either. Blip. Bloody blood. I love this. Ugh. Even he's like, ooh. Right? <laughs> Maybe don't reveal yourself. I know. Can you, like, stitch that back? 
Undo, undo. <laughs> Control Z. <laughs> also, you're like stabbing into the floor and there's a child under the floor. Yeah, it was the 60s. The floor was like 50 feet down. True. Oof. Ugh. He can't. He can't. Ed, you're a bad exorcist. Same. You're not supposed to stop. <laughs> Did it work? <laughs> nah, she going upside down now. Well, in a second. Almost there. Kids. Yeah. Upside down time. That's... <laughs> he hasn't bandaged up his face fuck no just let it bleed it'll clot on its own you're freaking out now aren't you copper no no okay (laughs) yeah if you insist Boom! I mean, at least she let her, like, land on her back. Well, it's landing on the chair, let's be honest. That was a pretty slow fall. It was a big thing. I don't know. Oh! Laps. It creeps me out. Oh. Nope. 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 Walk away. No. Oh, God. Shotgun! (laughs) No. She's a quick little raccoon. She is. She's feisty. And then this little girl just walk away. Run away. (laughs) Feels like old school. Mama's limber. Yeah. Yep. Get it. I don't know. This whole scene like rubs me the wrong way. Yeah, that's like like, hyper cheesy. Like the power of love. And the white light and all that shit. Yeah, it's pretty bad. That's why, like, I love this movie, except for the last, Like, uh, ten minutes? The third quarter. The whole third quarter. I just, it's just a little weird. She also <sighs> looks like she has no teeth. Right. <laughs> the fucking white light. I can't do it. It's, it's God's grace. <laughs> also, if I was that fucking child, I would never trust my mother again. No, Fuck I would be no. traumatized. Hey, mommy, are you a demon? Right? <laughs> And at the end, she's all hugging her like, I'm so sorry, baby. I'm like, fuck you, Go mom. Go away. Fuck you, mom. <laughs> Vomit that bitch out. Ugh. <laughs> Is that getting rid of it, though? I mean... She Bathsheba vomited into Carolyn's mouth to go into her to possess her. I like that transition back to normal Carolyn. I don't. She still looks fucking creepy. Well, yeah, she's just been possessed. Yeah, and then the happy, somber music. I would kill to have all those cars in my Where front yard. Where the fuck are all the dead birds that were, like, crashing into the car? There's oh, no yeah, birth. true. The sun. 
She's like, oh my god, I can see. My bruises are going away. No, nope, fuck nope, you, nope, mom. No, nope, no. Nope. Yeah, <laughs> she's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Time to leave. Right. Oh, and they're just casually. Why? How? Everyone I guess... just casually trusts mom. I like her cardigan. Me too. They're so cute. They're like matching. Yeah. How precious. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Same. It's a weird crane. Just like... (laughs) I like the music. It's pretty. It's weird, but it's pretty. What? Her locket. Oh. See, my dark vine went to... Here's a bird's head. (laughs) (laughs) Fucking hereditary. (laughs) Yeah, see? I'm so excited about that movie. Her hair would not be that perfectly curled. Fuck no. It would be flat and frizzy. (laughs) I like that house, though. That is gorgeous. Any house, old houses on the East Coast are both creepy and my goals. (laughs) (laughs) Get in there. I don't. Too little, too late. Let him know that Lorraine exercised her instead of Ed. That one's not so bad. Like he, he like said everything in here is dangerous, but this one's not so bad. This one's okay. It's just a little boy. What is that like? And behind. So, right here, that looks like Anubis. I think it's some, like, samurai outfit. Oh, no, it definitely is. It's the glare. Mm, No. (laughs) We all know what that is. Bloom. Diabolical forces are formidable. These forces are terrible. They exist today. The fairy tale is true. The devil exists. God exists. And for us as people, our very destiny hinges upon which one we... Blah, blah, blah. Which I one miss. we elect to follow. Sure. Ed Warren. Let it be. <laughs> I really wanted to see him. But you don't. Yeah, you don't it's see anything. Like a, it's a really good TBD. <laughs> I hate it. Just cuts to black. I wanted more. It looks like it's creepy glowing eyes right there. Doom. <laughs> love it. I love this movie. So good. All right. I See, like, so now this is the, the family. Yeah. But then around this time, like, Ed is not a pretty man. <laughs> I mean, yeah, no. It's okay. They did their and best. And Ju- Judy also looks like horrendously creepy. <clears throat> the house is cool. Ghost hunter. I love this end credit shit. It is so good. Yeah. Whenever they do the end credits really well, it's kind of like keeps you in it until the very end. Yeah. Sorry. That's pretty. I, I do want to go into their basement. That would be really cool. Do they have it open? Or does she have it open? Uh, She does tours every once in a while, but obviously you're not allowed to touch anything. Yeah. Um, But every once in a while, they'll they'll let you in. Ron Livingston. <laughs> Her hair is great. She is much prettier than Lily Taylor. <laughs> right. Sorry, Lily. I love those, like, little girl shoes. <laughs> Fucking creepy. You know, another place that I realized that I really wanted to put on our, um, like, 
uh, vision board hmm. is uh, doing haunted tours of uh, what's it, Louisiana? Fucking of the chicks house? No, the, oh no, just the the city, New, New Orleans. Orleans. <laughs> yeah, doing haunted tours of New Orleans. That'd be fun. Would be really cool because they have them. I still want to go to her house. What's her name? Fuck. Um. Crazy bitch of New Orleans. And done. Oh, I have no idea. Cool. So, official credits. Movie is done. Hour and 53 minutes. That's actually shorter than I thought it was going to be. I That's thought the not movie, too bad. I, for some reason, I thought the movie was like two hours and something. It feels like that. Once you get to the third act, oh my it God, feels... Oh my God, it drags. It really drags. But it's one of our favorite movies. And I like it. Yeah. It's good. That was fun. I think uh, we, we'll have to like listen and give us our, your feedback. Um, if you liked this, let us know. We're going to keep doing it until somebody says no. Well, I mean, we'll probably still keep doing it afterwards. But well, like, yeah. if the general consensus is keep fucking doing it or talk more. I think that might have been our only thing. But it's hard because like, sometimes you get so sucked into the movie and you're like, I don't want to talk right now. It's so intense. Well, I definitely know some people who can MST3K everything. So What is that? Mystery Science Theater 3000. I still don't know what that is. Oh, they play old shitty sci-fi movies and the main characters, you, you're like, they're in theater seats, mm-hmm. so you see their silhouette shadows, and mm-hmm. they, like, talk and make jokes oh, while they're cool. playing this, like, old crappy movie. That'd be cool. We should do, like, more guests of those, but it'd be harder unless they were actually here with us. We'll figure it out. We'll set it up. Let us know if you guys liked this, and let us know what other movies you want us to do mm-hmm. um, on Twitter or email us at uh, Rainbows and Horror Movies at gmail.com. And you can find us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook at RAHM Podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Who are we? Um, and my Instagram is at VK Dub, and Michaela's is at Interstellar Camper. You can see a bunch of adorable pictures of her new kitten. My baby. And yeah, that was fun. We can never change our handles now. I did on Twitter. But that's only because I changed it to my Instagram handle. Because it's the only one I say. I only say my Instagram handle. So if you're going to change anything, you should change your Twitter. But it's uh, Interstellar Campers too long for Twitter. Oh, fuck that. I know, right? I fucking hate, hate that shit. Hate it. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for listening. Bye. Bye.